in a European cultural sphere that is ever more hostile to Russia. Some are mistakenly conflating Putin's warmongering regime with the music of the Russian nation. Yuri Ravich, a Moscow-born violinist and composer, has witnessed this challenging cultural landscape firsthand. This despite being openly anti-war and helping Ukrainian refugees. I feel like nowadays people just like to put everyone in one box and if I have a first name which sounds Russian they'll just see me as a Russian without any taking in consideration what I'm doing. I had a concert in France cancelled already. I had a tour in Japan moved for two or three years. Russian composers such as Tchaikovsky have long been the mainstay of Russian culture abroad. Following Putin's invasion of Ukraine there has been a wave of cancellation for Russian musicians in Europe and America. I think instead of banning culture, one should concentrate on actual war, what's going on right now to help people who are suffering from the war, you know? That's the main thing, to help refugees, to help Ukrainians who are still in Ukraine, and to do everything possible to stop this war. You will not stop the war by boycotting Tchaikovsky's music. Yuri now cannot go back to Russia, having been vocal in his support of anti-dictatorial movements, such as the Oslo Freedom Forum, but says his main concern is for dissident musicians at home in Russia. Recently, a colleague of mine, Mr. Lubimov's concert was stopped by police because he was playing uh, music by Ukrainian composers, you know, and, but he still keeps on playing it. And we need to support these people who are doing anything what they can, you know, to raise awareness and to protest in Russia despite all these crazy laws which actually stop the people from protesting. As Putin's war of attrition rages on in the east of the country, the international community is acutely aware of the abhorrent humanitarian consequences of the war. But it remains to be seen how Russian society may be affected at home and abroad by these changes.